Elliott, SprintCarLimited.com with Matthew Henninger of Wicked Cushion, Wicked Energy Gum. Matthew, we see everywhere. What is Wicked Cushion? Wicked Cushion's a marketing company in the end. Uh, Wicked Cushion was created to bring attention to dirt track racing, to help support the drivers, the series, uh, the dirt tracks uh, that entertain us fans at you know 800 tracks across the country. We think it's an underserved market from a marketing perspective, and we think companies and brands are are missing out on a on a great way to market their products and services uh, through motorsports by going to the dirt tracks. It's more of a hands-on approach, and we're trying to uh, bring as much attention to the sport as we can. So how does it work? I know we've seen you on, obviously, Casey Kane's car is a Wicked Energy Gum car. You're on my podcast, which thank you. And you're also on a Brad Sweet, Darren Pittman, a Craig Kinzer, a Max Stamball, Carl Bowser, a lot of different teams. Uh, how's that work with, with the platform at Wicked Cushion? Yeah, the idea uh, as far as the, the marketing platform goes is to kind of showcase some of these up-and-coming guys by sponsoring quite frankly some of the more well-known guys by doing that we bring a lot of attention to the platform itself and so when people are coming to look at Casey Kane and see what kind of you know program he has and what results he's doing they're also going to find a Carl Bowser and a Max Stambaugh and from a branding and marketing perspective if someone interested in sponsoring a dirt track car maybe they don't have the budget for a Casey Kane but they may realize there's an opportunity with a guy like Carl or Max and they can find all of that on our platform yeah you kind of Craig Kinzer has Profile coming on the car. Profile is one of the companies you brought in that they have no exposure in sprint car racing or dirt track racing, and now they do. Yeah, it's really exciting, actually. That starts uh, next weekend at Devil's Bowl. Uh, we arranged the sponsorship for Craig through Wicked Cushion, uh, negotiated the contract, uh, you know, pay all the expenses, handle all of the at-track activities for Craig, and it's been really an amazing partnership already. Profile is really excited about what's going on in dirt track racing. They see it's a, a great avenue to expose their brand, which is growing tremendously all across the country, and it's a great, it, Craig's actually on their diet program. The kid's lost 25 pounds already. It's unbelievable. So it's really been a great relationship with Profile, and we hope to bring more sponsors like Profile to the sport. We just did a deal with Dave Blaine. Uh, j and Medical Supply out of Michigan. It's a big uh, medical distribution company. We'll be on Dave's car starting next weekend uh, with the All-Stars. So we've already brought our, our first two companies to, uh, to the platform and introducing them to this great sport. So is the interest level, obviously you just said about the two companies you brought in, is the interest level growing? I mean, I'm sure you get a lot of questions on what Wicked Cushion is, yeah. but uh, is is that interest growing? Yeah, it's really growing. And what we've done is we've we've dovetailed it. We've called a cross-aspect marketing platform. So we started actually in eSports, you know, on iRacing, which is, you know, kind of a virtual, you know, gaming platform. And we created teams and, 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 and marketing strategies there. We actually have six live broadcasts every week week you know on on iRacing this is called the Dirt Racing Network you can watch this stuff live on on Twitch or or Facebook so that is, is what got all the attention for us uh, initially with Wicked Cushion and then it just kind of grew from there and then you know we were on Darren Pittman's car at the Knoxville Nationals and then things kind of took off that got us a lot of exposure so a lot of companies are now calling us wondering what is this dirt track racing stuff because for the most part when people think of motorsports they think of NASCAR or Formula One and it pretty much ends right there and when they think of budgets related to that all they hear is millions of dollars and they think there's no possible way we could possibly be involved in motorsports and then we give them really cool facts right like that there's more dirt track tickets sold in the US than NASCAR the NFL and the NHL and I think one other sport combined and then it really gets their attention and we think you know it's uh, there's a lot more people coming because uh, we get a lot of calls and we're working on you know a half a dozen deals right now for different drivers are you pleased with how far this has come and where do you see this going in the future yeah I listen it's it, you know I don't know I'm trying to think what it was I don't know, eight months ago we didn't exist right <laughs> you know or maybe Ten months ago, I don't remember now, but uh, so w w there's a. I think there's a lot of opportunity. There's a lot, you know, dirt track racing is, uh, at least in my mind, picking up steam again a little bit. There's, you know, it's such a great platform because there's so many different divisions, there's so many different tracks, there's so many different ways that you can engage, you know, with your customers, and uh, so I think there's a lot of room for growth. There's a lot of opportunity for new companies that would love to be involved to get involved, and then there's the virtual world. You know, esports is growing like crazy. You know. Last year, esports had a billion dollars in total revenues. 
the amazing thing about that though is 40 percent 400 million dollars of that was just in marketing and sponsorships so there's this huge opportunity in bringing two really different demographics together the esports side is more of a younger demographic and then the motorsports side as we all know is a little bit older so sponsors get the opportunity to capture both on the same platform well matthew thank you very much for joining us at windy baps motor speedway check out Win wicked energy gum wicked cushion wicked energy gum is a great product and the wicked relief it, it might be even better I, I mean for me especially an old guy like me with shoulder problems again jeremy elliott sprint car limited.com with matthew henner baps motor speedway